Hey everyone, today let's dive into a fascinating topic that affects us all. The reality of perception. What you see, is it really what you get? Let's find out. Imagine this. You're walking down the street and you see a stick on the ground. But wait, is it really a stick or could it be a small snake camouflaged as a stick? Your heart might skip a beat until you take a closer look and realize, phew, it's just a stick. This simple scenario illustrates how our initial perception can be deceiving. Perception is our way of interpreting the world around us through our senses. But here's the kicker. It's not just about what's out there. It's also about how our brain processes what we see, hear, or feel. Now think about the famous dress that broke the internet. Was it blue and black or white and gold? People all over the world were divided, and it all came down to how individual brains process the ambiguous information. This phenomenon shows that even with the same visual information, our perceptions can differ drastically. What's really intriguing is that our experiences, expectations, and even our mood can influence our perception. If you've ever been hungry and suddenly everything reminds you of food, that's your perception being influenced by your current state. And it doesn't stop there. Cultural differences can also alter our perceptions. For instance, some languages have multiple words for what English speakers simply call snow. This linguistic variety can affect how speakers of those languages perceive and even notice the nuances of snow. So what you see isn't just what you get, it's filtered through a personal lens shaped by a myriad of factors, making each person's perception uniquely their own. This is why understanding perception can lead to greater empathy and communication. By acknowledging that others might see the world differently, we open ourselves up to a broader understanding of the human experience. And that, my friends, is the reality of perception. It's not just about the physical world, but how each of us experiences it in our wonderfully unique ways. So next time you're sure about what you're seeing or experiencing, take a moment to consider. There might be more to the picture than meets the eye. Thanks for tuning in. If you enjoyed this exploration into the quirks of human perception, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more intriguing insights. Catch you in the next video.